guys, my name is the Surfing Ginger. Welcome to a brand new video. And today, guys, of course, as promised, we're opening the two independence bundles, like I mentioned yesterday. But this has a uh, an added bonus because today being Saturday, we got two brand new Ultimate Legends, possibly the best running back in the game thus far. Ultimate Legend Walter Payton plus the Bruce Smith Ultimate Legend, guys. Let's go ahead and get right into it. I am so hyped. We have a very good chance of pulling these cards, and I think we will today. All right, let's go ahead and get started. We have 20 independence packs, plus, of course, the two toppers. I completely forgot what's in the toppers. I think it's like 10 gold or better, 4th of July players. Um, that's what I think it is. I'm not 100% sure, of course, but we have a big opportunity to pull these uh, Ultimate Legend cards, having 20 packs to open. So let's go ahead and see if we can do so. And okay. So take two commences. And finally, this pack open. There's only five cards again. That's kind of odd. I thought there'd be more. I guess these independence packs are like the exact same as the 4th of July packs yesterday. That's really odd. We do get a Matt, uh, Matt Irving, I think that was. Uh, we have a couple. We obviously have 19 more packs, though. So I was hoping these packs would have more items, but I'm going to have to take it. Four golds is not bad. It, it was, it's Nate Irving, not Matt Irving. My fault. My fault. Okay, we're going to keep going, though. Um, 18 more packs. I want to pull some nice hot fire, but it's very possible seeing that there's only five players in each pack or five cards that we won't. But let's go ahead and hope. One can only hope. Oh, we get 95 overall elite. Let's go. Dwayne Harris. Okay. That's nice. Uh, going into, of course, the Darren Sproles kick returner sets. It's really funny because this guy's a kick returner himself. He actually might go for some good good amount of coins. All the elites so far, I think, are going for over 100k. As you'll see in my coin making method video coming out later today for this promo. But with that being said, that's our first elite pull. I'll take that for sure. I thought it was something better, man. Obviously, I'm hoping for some ultimate legend pulls. Because there's not Ultimate Legend packs out. I should have waited to open mine. Because I opened the uh, opened my packs a couple days ago when they were out. The packs were out. I should have waited and had like one big huge pack opening for it today. Um, but you know, I'm very impatient. And when you see packs just sitting on your screen, you just want to open them. So it happens. It happens. Getting two players here. One being the Cairo Santos. That goes for about 25k. And of course, the Steven Wisniewski. If that's how you pronounce it. I'm not 100% sure. 84 overall and an 82 overall kicker. So we have about 14 more packs before the two toppers. And things have been looking pretty good so far. Obviously, we got an Elite already. An Elite 4th of July player, not just a regular Elite. And we're going to get another Perry Riley Jr. Not the best, not the worst, but I will take it nonetheless. Let's keep going, though. Ooh, baby, I want an Ultimate Legend. Not in this pack, though, getting another Nate Irving. That's very funny. That's my third pull, I think, of Nate Irving in, like, eight packs. So I guess he's pretty common. Those 84 overalls are pretty common, I'll say. It's, it's funny because you think that you would think the higher overalls would be less common gold wise But it seems like the kickers and punters are even less common as we get as I say that we get a Cairo Santos So it's actually kind of funny kind of debunks what I was trying to say um, Okay, let's keep going though. We got a Benny Van Wickery. I love that name. Come on, please ah, It's not happening. Okay, another Nate Irving get away. I don't want you anymore. I have enough of you Nate I have enough go away Exactly 10 more independence packs before we hit those two toppers. We have a good chance of pulling some ultimate legends in these 10 packs But of course not in the toppers. So let's see if we can pull out some ultimate legends in these packs Not in this one. We get a double uh, Fourth of July player pack with Cairo Santos and Steven Wisniewski again, that's why I think I had like the same exact combination a couple packs ago, which is funny I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and hit a topper right now because you know I can I I, I want to see what they are She decided to open and hit a quick reveal all and we're gonna get all Wow Wow, I guess it's 10 gold or better 4th of July players, but we got all gold Nice we got a Kyra Santos and we didn't get the kick returner at all. We did not get Travis Benjamin We want Travis Benjamin. He goes for like 70k which is funny because he's only like an 83 overall, but 70k overall, that's, that's a lot. That's a lot of coins. Nine more packs, of course. We're a little over halfway through. Ten packs, including the topper, but nine independence packs. And we're about to bundle in completely. Two Steven Wisniewski's there. Even though I'm not getting like the high, the better overall gold players most of the time, I can put them into that reroll set, which is nice. So if you guys get a lot of those, oh, we're getting an elite player here, Patrick Peterson, 90 overall kit or punt returner. Uh, but like I was saying, if you guys are getting gold players that you don't want, and 4th of July gold players, of course. You can put them into that reroll set, and then you'll hopefully get a Travis Benjamin or a Kyro Santos or Andy Lee, whatever the three kicker punt returner or whatever you want. And we're getting a double Nate Irving here. Man, I've gotten so many of him. I'll definitely be putting him in that reroll set. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to be completing the Darren Sproles right away. I'm going to try to wait for the prices to go down. 
Um, but we'll have to see. And we're going to be able to get a Nate Irving again, plus a Travis Benjamin. Oh my gosh, that's annoying. The fact that we got the Travis Benjamin movers and not the Travis Benjamin 4th of July just kind of made me mad. Five more independence packs, and then we'll have to call it quits before the topper, of course. Come on. Give me some nice elite pulls. We're going to get an elite collectible. All Is that an all rookie collect? Oh, it's an all pro pack. Okay, interesting. So maybe we'll pull out Ultimate Legend in that. Let's go ahead and claim that right now, because why not? Yeah, we got like nothing in this except for this Justin Houston base overall elites. 89 overall. Okay. So moving back into the independence packs, though. Four more to go, plus the topper. I, I'm looking forward to the top room, hoping for some better luck than I did in the first top. Our first top was really bad. We had all golds, which is obviously not what you want. Okay, come on, baby. Come on. We got an 85 overall linebacker, Ryan Kerrigan, it looks like. This art does not seem to be loading, but it is a Ryan Kerrigan. I'm pretty sure he's just his base card. Yeah, I guess so. Three more packs, though. Come on, let's get some nice, good pulls. We want another Independence Day Elite, another 4th of July Elite to put into the set. Three more packs, and we're gonna get nothing in this pack. Another, oh my gosh, Travis Benjamin, chill. Come in a different form. Evolve into your kick returning form, not your freaking movers, Roger right? Saber, man, that's annoying. Plus, of course, the Perry Riley Jr. Thought we pulled a double, a double 4th of July player there, but it turned out it was just a Travis Benjamin, which is stupid. Next pack coming up, and we're gonna get, it looks like nothing really. Another Steven Wisniewski. We haven't pulled two of the three cards that I wanted, Travis Benjamin and, of course, Andy Lee, the punter. I don't think we pulled Devontae Adams either, but he doesn't really matter because he's a low overall goal, or he doesn't go for much. Um, okay, keep going, the last pack before the topper, and we're getting a Bishop Sankey. Okay. So here we, are in the, here we are in the topper. Okay, we're hoping for some elite pulls. Maybe one. We'll, we'll go with one just because we don't want to be too greedy. We didn't pull anything the first one. Let's just keep going. Oh, right off the bat, another Dwayne Harris. Okay, already better than the first. Okay, already better than the first topper. Anything else, though? Looks like we just got one, but we did pull a Dwayne Harris. Oh, we got Travis Benjamin. I did not even look at that. That's nice. Okay, we got Travis Benjamin. I'll take that for sure. And finally, guys. We'll be able to uh, end this video with some nice pulls. I know we, we pulled two elite pulls. Obviously, D Dwayne Harris being the two pulls that we got for the 4th of July promo. And we got pretty much all the gold players besides two, I think. Or besides one. Because I think it pulled Devontae Adams in the last topper. Uh, but with that being said, guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. Sadly, did not pull an Ultimate Legend. But honestly, you can't really hope for that. Uh, but for now, guys, thank you all so much for watching. I am over and out. And I'll talk to all of you beautiful people later. See ya.